These past few weeks have really gave me a new perspective on life. It's made me realize how precious life really is. If you don't know me, my name is Emily. And a few weeks ago, my grandpa was put in the hospital. It was three days before Christmas. Growing up, my grandparents were like my second set of parents. I spent every weekend at their house. It seemed like I was there, or at least saw them, every day. They were the only people I'd actually ever spent the night with until I was over a teenager. I was probably 15. Long story short, they've always been the rocks of our entire family. Me and my family were at church one Wednesday night when we got the call that my grandpa had been taken to the ER. To be quite honest, we were very unhopeful because they were suspecting he had heart failure. But after they ran tests, they came to the conclusion that it was just his medication that he had started taking a higher dosage of than he usually did. But they took x-rays because his breathing was not well and they wanted to see his lungs and make sure his heart was okay. After they took the x-rays, they found that there was blockages and they did not know how bad, so they decided that they were going to do a heart gas. At this point, it was Christmas. We spent Christmas in the hospital and then ate at a Chinese restaurant, which is so strange because our family always gets together on Christmas, but we were just glad that he was still with us and we were all together. During the heart cath, they found major, major blockages in all three arteries in his heart. They also found that he needed a valve replacement. It was pretty urgent, so they sent him to where they were more capable of doing open heart surgery. It was about a three hour procedure, and during those three hours, it was some of the most anxious and uncertain times of my life. After his procedure, he was left on the vent for a couple hours, as well as he was still sedated. That was one of the hardest things I've ever had to see. It was definitely a wild ride, but thank the Lord, yesterday he got off the vent, and God has definitely been faithful through all of this. We know it's going to be an extremely long road to recovery, but we are so blessed that He is still with us. My mom, who y'all usually see on the channel, Andrea, has spent most of the past few weeks with them, being there, comforting them, and doing anything that they need. While she's been there, we've been holding down the fort and doing what we need to. The other day I was driving and just blasting my worship music and thanking the Lord for how faithful He has been through all of this. I looked up and I saw the prettiest sunset. God has been so evident through all of this and it's just making me enjoy the little moments in life like the pretty sunsets, or a smile a stranger gives you, because life's too precious and short to pass by the little things. Take a second out of your day to tell someone you love them, or give them a hug, because you don't know when your last moment with them will be. Trust me, life can change in an instant, so enjoy every moment.